hi guys welcome back to kids nation today we are going to be doing a different kind of video we are going to be doing a snack review or uh, a snack unboxing and review video all of the snacks are in this box and this actually came from amazon yes amazon.com and these are world worldwide treats and i have asian snacks so snacks from different parts of asia are in this box and you can do european snacks turkish snacks asian snacks so worldwide treats i'm i'm expecting a great deal today i've never tried this snack box before so i'm happy to be doing this on my channel so i'm going to open it and this was for 20 something us including shipping i think it was either 30 or 29 US I'll put on the all the information in the description box below and I am kind of hustling with this video because persons are in and out of this room and I don't want to have to be stopping my video every minute I'm trying to open it so when I open it this is what you see all the snacks and then there is a letter we do a quick thumbnail okay i'm back so these are all of the snacks i can't remember what's the count maybe 17 or so so this is what it looks like and the i don't feel like reading the note but this is a note that was given so we are going to try some snacks the first snack the first thing we're going to be trying is the now the thing is I've tried all of these before because I filmed the video but I hated the quality so we're now going to refilm the entire video. Well, most of it. The first thing is banana cake. This is a banana snack with artificial flavor and this is from Korea. This is what it looks like. It's like a compo with uh, artificial banana taste. I'll give it a six and a half out of ten. Next we have butter coconut sweet biscuit. I don't know who this is from. This is what they look like. There is a mild coconut taste to it. It is not as thin as a saltine cracker, but it's not as dense as a really, like a shortcake cookie. So it's like in between. It tastes really good. It kind of tastes like a graham cracker. I love these, I'll give these an 8 out of 10. Next we have, uh, I have them all wrapped up. Oh! Dewberry, blueberry and cream. And this is from the Philippines. came with three cookies. I ate one last night. My husband ate one. And this is the last one. This is what it looks like. There's a blueberry kind of jam, jellyish kind of thing there. Cream inside. Biscuit. The blueberry thing is sticky, but the biscuit and the cream, the taste is good, so I'll give that an 8 out of 10. Next we have a brownie chocolate chip cookie, brown rock.
I already ate a piece of it. This is what it looks like. There's a chocolate filling. This tastes something like a biscuit. The cookie is soft, soft, and the filling is okay. I'll give this a six and a half. Next we have um, bourbon ch chocolate. I probably butchered that, but it's a biscuit with a chocolate center. I'll give this a seven. Next we have same bourbon. It looks like it's white rolita, white rolita. This is what it looks like. It's like a white chocolate, a biscuit covered with white chocolate or cream. I'll give this a, a five. Next we have chocolate nuts. Chocolate nuts. Not nuts, but nuts. And it is chocolate coated pretzels and it says no with milky of chocolate. And this is also a product of the Philippines. This is what they look like. It's like a pocky stick in the shape of a pretzel with cho milk chocolate. That's an 8 out of 10. Then we have Earl Grey Grapefruit. This is a soft cookie with a grapefruit filling. It has the taste of grapefruit, pink grapefruit. No grapefruit. It's true to the taste. It's very grapefruity. Tastes good. Sweet, but not too sweet. Um, seven and a half. Next we have. There was this. Something that I can't pronounce because it's in Japanese or Chinese or Taiwanese or something. <laughs> My husband liked this the most. It was a chocolate chip cookie. This was his favorite. Next we have custard cream cake, spongy soft cake filled with rich custard cream. This is what the packaging looks like. And this is what the cake itself looks like. It looks like a muffin with a egg yolk filling. Tasty, because I had it before. It smells as if rum is in it, but it doesn't taste like rum. It's like a soft cake with a nice filling. It also came with gummies, but I don't eat gummies, so I won't be trying these. Mm. It came with this sweet. There is a guava flavor and a pineapple flavor. I think this was one of the, if not the best tasting things in the box. Um, I gave them a 9 out of 10. Like really, really tasty. This one is green while the other is yellow. It's just like a circle. Already ate this. Already ate this. This is green. This is yellow. Amazing. Tasty, tasty, tasty. I was like, oh, I don't eat sweets. And then I popped this in my mouth and it was amazing. There were a few other things in here. Oh. The last one that I'm going to try is seaweed ah. and it says it is premium seaweed winter harvest season and roasted seaweed and it is a product of Korea. This is the final thing that I will be trying. It's 
paper thinner, smells just like seaweed fishy. It tastes like a fish, a fried fish, but yet fresh fried fish. And you do taste a hint of salt here and there. There's quite a few, so for those who like seaweed, you're going to enjoy this. If you don't like seaweed, you're not going to like this at all. It's seaweed with um, seasoned, but lightly, very lightly seasoned. Well, I don't know what an unseasoned seaweed tastes like, but this is to me the taste of seaweed with just little sprinkles of salt. So if you like seaweed, you'd love this. If you don't, stay far. This will get like a three out of 10. Now my overall thoughts on this box is that for the price, I wish that we got more full size snacks as opposed to smaller. Um, snacks and little samples here and there. I prefer that we had bigger full size um, snacks as well. I prefer that we got more savory items as opposed to sweet items. The only savory item was this. And we, they could have put in peanuts, chips, crackers, something salty, spicy, savory as opposed to so many sweets. And they could have put in um, actual chocolate as opposed to chocolate flavored or chocolate chips to put in an actual chocolate so those are my recommendations and those are my comments overall the box was a good box i enjoyed the things that i ate it was a different experience because i never would have tried these things if i didn't purchase this box from amazon i definitely would encourage you to get yourself one of these boxes and you can get as i stated you could get a turkish box you could get a box from the middle east from europe this one is the asian box definitely try it let me know how you enjoyed it and i believe i'll be doing more snack boxes on this channel because i enjoy eating and i love reviewing have a good day guys love you and god bless oh my favorite was the the sweets that i showed you my personal favorite and the least definitely would be the seaweed. Mm -hmm. And the most interesting would be the banana, banana snacks. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys, and love you.